What's up, Copy Squad? It's your boy, Kyle Milligan, coming to you live from Delray Beach, Florida, and today I want to talk about the cardinal rule of copy and why you should never forget it. But it's really important to understand that we're always persuading, okay? So copywriting is not just something that we do in just a sales letter. Copywriting, the lessons of copywriting, the ability to persuade and speak directly to someone's emotional brain and get them on board with your ideas is a universally applicable social skill and professional skill like there is no boundaries to the use of copywriting and someone's DMing me on Instagram or Twitter and they usually come with their hands out like because I have a YouTube channel I owe them something like I have to stop what I'm doing and tell them step by step by step how to fix their life and at the end of the day I'm still just a person looking at their phone and you have neglected the cardinal rule of not only copywriting but just general persuasion and that is what's in it for me bro now what I want to do is kind of show you like through copywriting exactly how you can kind of like get to the point get someone's attention and then at the same time like give them what they want so I can show you with like copywriting like how this works in practical use and how how it's like easily executed this is what I've been looking at recently and it's kind of one that's sort of puttering out at Agora Financial. This is for uh, Mike Burnick's Amplified Income. And I love how simple and basic and direct to the point the first opening lines are. So your three-step retirement plan, okay? So right away he's telling you he's got three steps that'll help you retire. It's a short three-minute phone call. You don't have to invest much. It's very easy to do. Just type this into your brokerage account. Okay, I'm going to show you what to do. Great. Get ready to retire multimillionaire. Bam, all I gotta do is take three minutes, I get an awesome result, a multimillionaire by April 11th, okay? So dear reader, in the next 60 seconds, I'm gonna show you how you could retire a multimillionaire as early as April 11th. All right, so no matter who you are, this is beneficial. Like, I, I don't have to do, you don't have to persuade me to at least, at least read the next sentence and see what it is you're talking about. There's an obvious benefit conveyed to me immediately. All right, so this is obviously like a direct response sales letter example. But it doesn't matter, like copywriting and persuasion is universal. You know what I haven't done yet? Go to kylethewriter.com forward slash book. You should check out my book on copywriting. It's called Take Their Money. And it'll basically teach you how to speak to the emotional center of the brain like we're doing here. And I'll show you like how this stuff works, how you can cut to the chase, how you can trigger the buying emotions in someone's brain and get them basically buying all your stuff. kylethewriter.com forward slash book. So yeah, so here's a great example of cutting straight to the chase. What's in it for me? I know here. I know here, and then I know once again here. I'm gonna retire a multimillionaire. Like, of course I'm gonna read a little bit more. And then all you need to get started is a small amount of startup capital, a telephone, and access to a computer. Then you have these three things, congratulations, you have everything you need. So in this, like above the fold, like I don't even really have to scroll down. I already know that there's a big promise right here in front of me, something great, an awesome opportunity, and guess what? It doesn't really require much of me. All I need are these three simple things. So whenever someone hits me up and says, I have a business proposal for you, what's what business proposal? It doesn't help that the dude is a Bitcoin miner on his info. So that's like, okay, that just screams scam already, right? So his info says, I'm a Bitcoin miner. He has a business proposal for me. Well, I have no interest in Bitcoin or crypto or anything like that. Doesn't tell me what's in it for me. Doesn't tell me what the business proposal is about. He just says, I want to get to know you. Tell me about yourself. No way, dude. Like, why am I going to start? It's like, okay, yeah, so I grew up in uh, blah, 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 and I went to blank school, and I mastered in this, and I majored. Like, what? what? Why would I ever stop to talk to you? Right? That's the point. That's, that's like, that's not to be rude, and that's not to be like, I'm really important. I don't have time for you. That's every human being who ever reads anything. I'm talking about DMs. I'm talking about Instagram posts. I'm talking about these sales letters. Any human being who ever reads anything wants to know what's in it for them. All right? So the faster you get to the chase, right? Someone always messages me like, how do I get clients? Bruh, I try my best to give you some information about how to write compelling copy. And if you can't write compelling copy, then you just can't get clients. Because if you can't convince someone to hire you, how are you going to convince someone to buy something? Right? How do you get clients? Let me tell you really quick. Sell something and then show the results of you successfully selling something to a potential client. If your dude is selling pickles, right? I got this jar of pickles and I can't sell it. How do I sell it? And then, or let's say he's selling it okay and you can help him sell it better. Well, what you can do is you can create a pickle jar product, a jar of pickles, and you can sell it and be like, hey guy who sells pickles, 
I noticed you're trying to sell your pickles and I have some good advice for you. Because if you look over here at these results of mine, I've sold a sh bunch of pickles, right? So now I'm qualified to help you. Like just because you read a book doesn't make you qualified to take over the marketing and copy of somebody else's business. You, you, you gotta go out there and you have to be able to persuade them to hire you. If you cannot persuade them, then you are not qualified to persuade the masses to buy their product, right? So you need to be able to persuade. And the first thing you need to be able to do is demonstrate and immediately articulate what's in it for me, no matter who your audience is, who you're talking to. Now, if you wanna learn more about copywriting, how to write it yourself and write it successfully using the tactics that Help me generate $7.1 million in 2018, which are the big four buying emotions. They're called new, easy, safe, and big. I tell you all about that inside my book. It's called Take Their Money. It's available at kylethewriter.com forward slash book. Thanks so much for tuning in. Peace out, Copy Squad.